Oh, stand by for a start, and they're off. And they're racing for the Bahrain Derby Cup, and Tharb just uh, jumped out to his left as the gates opened, as they go down the side of the course. On the inside is Horatio being taken on for the early advantage by Mudalala and Neil Callan to the outside, and between horses Amwaj and Andrea at Zini as they form that order around that first turn. At the moment, Van Halen not really settling. Paul Hannigan trying to switch Van Halen off in the dark blue jacket. has got two behind. They are Black Shadow and Tharb. So already fairly well spaced out with 10 lengths top to tail as they move on down the back straight and the pace setter is Horatio. Horatio by about three lengths followed by Amwaj in second place. Gap then of two and a half to Mudalal. Still pulling hard over racing for Paul Hannigan is Van Halen in fourth position ahead of a Black Shadow and Tharb brings up the rear. They are now beginning just to close ranks of fraction. The leader still with three lengths on them though is Horatio. It's Horatio being followed by Amwaj and then the white cap of Mudalal and on the outside, Mudalal with Black Shadow to the running rail. Break then of another couple of lengths to Van Halen and Tharb is currently an observer, making the run inside the final 800 and approaching the turn into the straight and it is still Horatio on top by two lengths with Amwaj on the outside of Black Shadow. Just off those two is Mudalal being chased by Van Halen as they prepare to straighten up at the 600 and Tharb remains in last place trying to go for home is Horatio Horatio by about a length Amwaj now called on for an effort on the inside Black Shadow with nowhere to go on the running rail Mudalal is on the outside and going with Mudalal now being produced by Paul Hannigan is Van Halen heading down towards the last 200 it's Mudalal and Van Halen now and the gloves are off as these two duel for the lead they've kicked away from Amwaj the rail runner is Mudalal on the near side is Van Halen who's trying to pass Mudalal Mudalal and Van Halen Van Halen on the outside, edging there, close home, Van Halen the winner. Didn't settle early, he's come home well, Van Halen beats Mudalal, tight for the other places, Black Shadow and Amwaj, they're clear of Tharb and Horatio. So Van Halen has won it, Paul Hannigan and uh, Alan Smith teaming up, Al Adiat Racing takes the Bahrain Derby Cup, Van Halen and Mudalal had a tremendous duel inside the final 200 metres and it is number six, Van Halen who hits the line Best of all to take the Bahrain Derby Cup from Mudalal in a second place. And they skipped several lengths clear of the others. Two in-form four-year-olds battling to the line. And it's Van Halen who takes top spot from Mudalal second. And Black Shadow, best of the rest, in third. Well, let's have a word with winning jockey Paul Hannigan. Paul, he didn't give you an easy job to start with through the race, but he certainly came, came through. He's got plenty of talent, this one. <laughs> I think my arms are a couple of inches longer. Um, it was a bit stop-start, the race. To be fair to him, he's, you know, he's won, I think, four out of five now, or three out of four. He's still a baby. You know, he's improving all, all the time. You know, still mentally not there, but uh, just delighted for Shaky. So, you know, it's a, a lovely homebred race to win on on a big and important day like today as well and you've been knocking on the door in the in the big races we've had so far this afternoon yeah i mean it's been a terrific season over here um but it's just nice to get some of these big ones and um it's nice to see international runners doing so well over here as well because it's only going to improve by rain for the for the better and um it's great to see well congratulations with Winning the Bahrain Derby then on Van Halen, a very talented horse. And Paul, as I said, has been getting plenty of places this afternoon, so nice to see him in the winner's enclosure in those colours of Al Ariat Racing. Well done to Van Halen, Paul Hannigan and Alan Smith.
Wonderful reception from the crowd, perhaps the best of the afternoon as Paul Hannigan liveried in the silks of Shekis as Al Adiat Racing comes into the winner's enclosure on Van Halen playing all the right notes in the Bahrain Derby. Were you confident that he was going to go and pick up the leader? Yeah, yeah, he's got a good turn of foot and he stays stays 2,000 metres well. Um, and he's just an improving horse. He'll be a better horse next year. These local breads, they take time to come to their cells. You know, normally they don't reach their peak until about five. But that's the great thing about training here. We can give horses time. You know, they're happy to let you take your time and let horses mature properly. He was quite keen early, wasn't he? Is that just a thing he just needs to settle down a bit? Uh, he just needs a stronger pace, you know, that's all, yeah. And what next? Uh, he might go for the Owners' Cup at the end of the season, so, but we'll see. That's an open book, might finish him for the season, we'll see. Either way, bright future, well done. Yeah, thanks very much, cheers, thank you. The result is now official, wade in, wade in. And so we come to the presentation for the Bahrain Derby. Sheikh Nasser presenting the trophy to His Highness uh, Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, also chairman of the High Committee of the Rashid Equestrian Horse Racing Club. For his horse, Van Halen, trained by Alan Smith, ridden by Paul Hannigan. Your Highnesses, thank you and many congratulations.